what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? If you're familiar with my commentary, then you know that I am dedicated to exposing fuckboys. Now, you know if there are fuckboys, there's got to be fuck girls out there, right? If you've never seen one before, allow me to help you out. This is Brooke Craig. This clown was arrested for killing her boyfriend's seven-year-old son. Let me tell you how it went down. So there's a domestic dispute and the boyfriend hops in the car with his son to take off. She comes out of the house with the gun, firing away. She hit the little boy. Somehow the little boy gets separated from the father and her, the little boy uh, ends up at a hospital. The cops comes to the house. They don't know that, they don't know about the situation with the little boy yet. They go to the house for the disturbance. They figure everything is normal. At the same time, they get the call, we got this little kid here with a gunshot wound. They make the connection, they go looking for the girl and the boyfriend. They find them in the parking lot of a Walgreens store. Old girl smashed the gas, take off on a one-way street, on a dead-end street. At this point, the police jam her up. She hit the front end of one of the cop cars. They stop them, they make the arrest, and they tell their side of the story. Now, they arrest the girl on capital murder charges. I don't know why they didn't give her also an attempted murder charge on the boyfriend. The boyfriend got locked up on a parole violation. Now, here's the $50,000 question. I don't know why people say $50,000 question. Some, well, some people say $60,000 question. Hey, it's whatever thousand dollars you want it to be. But here's the question. She shoots his son. Why is this fool in the car with a woman who just killed his son? Why is he on the run with her? Man... What kind of society do we live in, man? Man, I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you that the moral fiber of this society has deteriorated so much, I don't know if we can be saved. I just don't know. And I'm going to tell you right now, you can pray on it all you want, but prayer without work is dead. Man, you got to, and, and we can't law ourselves away. We can't law ourselves out of this jam. We can't sentence ourselves out of this jam. Because that's the American way. Uh, hang them, uh, put them in jail. 30 years, 50 years, 100 years, just put them in jail. Lock them up, lock them up, lock them up, lock them up. You're locking all of these people up, and it's still getting worse and worse, which tells you it doesn't work. Just locking people up is not the answer. How about a government that leads the way, leads the people, that rewards good behavior from not just citizens, but the people, the government officials who are out here that's creating the whole climate in the first place. They're all corrupt. A lot of the people feel hopeless. I'm not saying that that is an excuse at all. I wouldn't give these clowns an excuse for nothing. But for them to 
run around here playing holier than thou, acting like they're representing the people and they're so corrupt. It's just going to be hard to get through it. They've taken away money from prevention programs. They take money from after school programs. They, they defund schools and fund prisons. I mean, just everything is just backwards. It's like, you know, it's an old saying, don't tell me what you care about. Show me your budget and I'll tell you what you care about. When y'all get a chance, take a look at America's budget for this year. And for the next few years, take a look at the budget. And that'll tell you what they care about, what they spend the most money on. That'll tell you. Whatever the story is behind why the girl and the, and the boyfriend got into it in the first place, it's totally irrelevant. You know, just whatever they was fighting over, it doesn't matter. To kill that little kid, an innocent kid, get caught up in his and, and in fact, it wasn't even his mother. That was the girlfriend. So for, can you imagine how the mother must feel? Wow. And she was, from what I understand, she, old girl that did the shooting was a thought. <laughs> Incredible, man. If you look at that mug shot, check out this mug shot. She looks like demons she looks like demons are worrying her this woman is a special kind of evil throughout history men have done some demonic things women are not quite in position to take the crown but they are challenging, big time. No more talk. What the haters talking about?